Hi Taurus, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. It may or may not resonate with all of you. Now let's start. First let's shuffle four times. Let's see first what happened in the past, so you better know if this is your reading. So we have the Fool and the Hangman in the reverse in the position of the challenge. At the bottom we have the Nine of Wands in the reverse. I think this person was a bit immature in uh, love and a bit stubborn as well. They may have not waited much or worked harder for the connection to work. This is what I see as the main challenge in the past. Now let's see about your current energies. What are your current energies? You want to focus more on yourself, maybe even on your work, your career, your job, but mostly you want to put focus on yourself and finally make a decision about the past, not being so indecisive. Let's see about what may be affecting you in your subconscious. The fact that there may have been a marriage there. Uh, both of you may have had created a family. This is the first story. The second story is that your love was the powerful and important. And you feel sad that it happened like that. So take what story resonates with you. Let's see what is your overall energy for the time frame of this reading, that is for the third week of May. I think that you don't want to rush any commitment immediately after what happened in the past. You want to take it one step at a time and not rush anything important. Let's see how do you view the situation with them. You want to heal from this past wounds of the past and you are feeling distant emotionally with this person. Now let's see more details. It is the same uh, message that you hope for things to get improved and move towards something serious, but you don't want to rush anything serious immediately. You want to be extra sure that the person with whom you want to share your life with will be the right one. And uh, your hope is that the connection you will be in is the right one, is harmonious, is give and take, balance, and not a one-sided story. Now let's see about their energy. What is their current energy towards you? This person thinks that connection is very dramatic, with lots of arguments, and mostly they kind of focus in the past problems, not in the past good moments, unfortunately. They feel sad and maybe even regretting that it happened like that. For now they want to remain single, independent, and they, they think that this way they will be more happy. Now. Let's see about if they will take any actions towards you, or their possible actions towards you, if any, for the time frame of this reading. I see them waiting, not rushing anything towards changing, changing this situation. They are just waiting, thinking and planning, but not wanting to take action immediately. I will continue this story now in the extended with more with more details. If you want to watch the extended, you can find it now in the description box below. See you at the next reading and bye for now.